All right, so the download has finished, and now I'm going to go ahead and close the browser and take a look at my desktop. So here on my desktop, I can see the zipped file. I'm going to right click on this and say and select extract all. Then I'm going to just choose where I want to extract the files to. In this case, it's telling me that it's going on my desktop. That's that looks good. So I'll just click extract. Okay, it may take a few minutes to extract all the files. There's over one gig of data in there. Sometimes this can take a while. Okay, the file has finished extracting and now it's going to automatically open up a window. So I'm looking at um, the extracted files here. I can also see the files on my desktop. Um, just searching for the folder. There it is, entire collection. So now I have these folder, these files on my desktop. I'm going to double click this USB and now you can see I have all the files available here. Um, you can go ahead and put these files wherever you like. If you want to put them on a, a zip drive, a USB drive, you can do that just by dragging these over. Now if you want to open them with your CAM software, uh, you're going to want to launch your cam software. In this case, we'll, we'll use Sheet Cam. So I'll go ahead and launch that. Now I'm going to say that I'm going to go ahead and import. So I'll go down here to import drawings. And then I'm going to select the desktop. That's where I saved my files. And then I will navigate to this new folder that was created. Again, click on USB. And now I can search for any of the files that I'm looking for. In this case, I'll come into bird hunting here. Now, if you're not seeing anything in the folder, it's probably because you have a certain file type selected. In this case, I have SVG files. I can click on this and select DXF and that's going to show me all the DXF files. I will select Bird Hunting 1 and Open. Configure your drawing options and then select Open. Now here you can see I've opened the file. So this is uh, how you would go from downloading the files, extracting them, and then opening them with uh, your CAM software, in this case, SheetCam. Thanks, I hope that helped.